Hey, this is Silas Williams from Harper Woods High School. Welcome to my first Tech Minute. I like to highlight Blubber.tv. I found this site. Um, it's a wonderful way for you to create and play video trivia games focused around YouTube videos. Uh, I think it's a wonderful way for teachers to review with their students. I think it's great for st students to prepare for quizzes and tests. So what do you need? You need two things. One, you need to create a free account. Um, you can either log in with your uh, Google Plus or your Google account, or you can create your own username and password. And the second thing you need is an actual YouTube video that you can parse and you can insert your questions into. Okay, after you've logged in, let's go ahead and click I want to create my own triv. Enter a title for your triv. I'll call this social studies sample. Then also, now you search for the video that you like to use. So I'll just copy and paste this entire name, the Civil War Part 1. And I'll go over here and right click and paste that. Press enter. And here's the video. All right, so this first area, uh, number one, is where you search for your YouTube videos. Secondly, this is where you crop your videos. In fact, this is how you enter questions by cropping the videos. Uh, number three, this is where you insert all of the questions um, with the correct answer and three other wrong answers. And then lastly, uh, step number four, uh, you click I'm done whenever you're ready to publish your video. While you're working on the video, you can also preview. Okay, so here's your video. The first thing that I want to look at is how to insert your question. In order to insert your question or create a question, you first have to crop out space on your timeline. So I've created a 16 second marker here from the 49 second mark to the 106 mark. And this poses a great question for me. Listen to it. Ha ha ha, 700,000 people died. Mr. Green, Mr. Green, actually only 680,000 people died. Yeah, it depends on how you count, you sniveling little goo. So I'm going to use this as my first question. How many people died during the Civil War? So the correct answer is 680,000 to 800,000. And then you fill in the rest of the wrong answer items with incorrect answers. And then you click add question. It's just that simple. Okay, so when you're ready to insert your next question, you drag um, your, crop, your timeline so you can crop the specific um, area. Notice I've cropped or chopped a 15 second marker here. So I'll just click and play that, give me an example. So spoiler alert, the Union won the war, which in a sense is unsurprising because they had massive advantages. For starters, they had many more people, approximately 22 million as compared to 9 million in the South, of whom... So that's a great question. I'll ask, what was the population of the North during the Civil War? And I like uh, Blubber because it gives the correct answer and also give you um, options for three wrong answers. So I'll put 22 million as well as the wrong answers. Okay, so you've got two questions, but you need a total of five questions. Once you've got your five questions, you can either click preview or click I'm done. Insert a title, select the category, select publish. Okay, so here's a list of your videos here that you've created. And if you'd like to share that to a web page, you can either embed the, the uh, quiz or you can have a direct link. If you have a direct link, uh, you would just copy and paste that and place that into your URL. 
or into your web page or your Moodle page and then students can take the quiz from there. All right, so this is what your blubber and other than slavery, looks like. Because that is just so early 20th century. And number four, there will not be a lot of jokes today because ha 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 ha, 700,000 people died. Mr. Green, Mr. Green, actually only 680,000 people died. Yeah, it depends on how you count, you sniveling little ghoul. But recent estimates are between 680,000 and 800,000 total casualties, deadlier for America. So there's the first question. Um, if you remember from the video, it should be 680,000. You answer that question, then you move to the next. And it's just that simple. Very nice. So let's start with some basic facts about the American Civil War. 1861 